Hi there. My name is Ross McDonald, and I'm a solutions engineer here at Kong. Today, we'll be doing a quick demonstration of the Kong Connect Service Hub, Runtime Manager, and Vitals features. During this demonstration, we'll show you how you can manage your API ecosystem from a single location, empowering your developers to search, discover, and consume existing services to both accelerate overall speed of development, as well as improve the adoption of your existing API services. We'll also demonstrate how you can use Runtime Manager and Vitals to gain insights into how deployed services are operating and how you can apply policy to manage and protect those services. With that, let's get to it. So when I first log in to Connect, the first thing I'll see here is the Service Hub interface. From here, I can see all the APIs that are defined within my environment. This provides a single pane of glass for every service managed within Connect, allowing teams to build a comprehensive catalog of the APIs across their environment, regardless of whether they're running in the cloud, containers, dedicated instances, or even multiple environments at once. From here, I can also search for services, as well as see versions, users defined in the system, and more. This makes it easy to find and discover new services that I may not have even known about before. Each of these services receives traffic through gateway runtimes that I've deployed out within my infrastructure. These runtimes are managed through the Runtime Manager. Here you can see a list of all the runtimes we currently have deployed, along with their IPs and when they were last seen. I can use the Configure Runtime option here at the top to create new runtimes. This provides me either with a quick start script that can be used to spin up a Docker-based gateway or I can use the advanced option if I want to tailor specific aspects of my runtime. For example, if I'm running in a Kubernetes or Linux-based environment. So as a user of Connect from a single interface, I can see all the runtimes that I've deployed inside of my infrastructure. I can see all the available services and service versions here within Service Hub. And if I drill down into one of my services, I get detailed information about how the service is performing with the vitals metrics that get exposed. This data can be exported directly from the Kong interface and integrates with all the popular metrics and analytics providers that you're already using today. For example, Datadog, Prometheus, Elasticsearch, and more are all supported out of the box. As I drill down further into a service version, again, I have my vitals data coming in real time for this version. I can link an open API specification, which will power documentation for a developer portal. I can create and see routes, showing me how requests get connected to each service. And lastly, the, the plugins and policies that are applied. As an example of how quickly policy is applied, I can update the plugins on the service and immediately see the changes propagated to my runtimes. Before I make this change, I'm going to pull up Insomnia, which is Kong's API design, debugging, and testing toolkit. From Insomnia, I can send requests to my gateway runtime and get a JSON response back. The response here is just a JSON representation of what the service saw in the request. And you'll note that there's a Kong request ID included here. This is created by the correlation ID plugin. So if I disable this plugin and resend the request, you'll note that it's no longer present. I can quickly return, re-enable it. And it's now been re-enabled within the gateway runtime. If I enable the rate limiting plugin here and go back to Insomnia, send the request, you'll notice I now see rate limit headers returned. And if I send several requests at once, you'll notice I get an error of 429 coming back. Disabling the plugin from the UI, and now everything is back to normal. So no matter where the runtimes are located, you can manage the entire fleet of gateways at the same time right here from the Connect interface.
To quickly recap, we've shown how the Runtime Manager can be used to spin up and manage Kong gateways across any hybrid, multi-cloud, Kubernetes, and self-hosted infrastructure in a simplified and automated way. How Service Hub enables building a comprehensive catalog of heterogeneous services, enabling improved service consumption and end-to-end -end lifecycle management. And lastly, how Vitals Data provides a central view of all the services and runtimes with real-time analytics and enables integration with your existing monitoring solutions. So regardless of whether you're a developer, operator, or architect, Connect provides you with the tools and information you need to effectively develop for, maintain, and govern your services and supercharge your API ecosystem. Thank you for watching this quick demo of Kong Connect. For more information, go to konghq.com. Until next time.